Hello, my name is Florin Gando and I'm an Associate Professor of Neurology at Macquarie University in Sydney. And I'm also a member of the steering committee of the MDS MSA study group. And I have treated MSA patients over many years. Today I want to talk to you about a very characteristic clinical clue in MSA. A very typical sign in patients with multiple system atrophy is an irregular twitching of the hands and fingers during positioning tasks. So when patients are asked to hold out their hands, you will be able to appreciate irregular movements, very brief, very low amplitude, involving one or two fingers, sometimes also involving the whole hand, and they are in upwards and downwards direction. These movements can be briefly intensified after isometric tasks, for example, pushing against the hand of the examiner, and then you will see that those movements briefly intensify. In contrast to a classical positioning tremor that we can see in patients with essential tremor, or in a more lateralized way in patients with Parkinson's disease, those irregular movements that we can observe in MSA are irregular and lack rhythmicity and therefore they can't be called tremor. They have previously been attributed as mini polymyclonus or polyminimyclonus and this term has recently come under debate and should be revised. I hope this helps you to identify patients with MSA in your daily clinical practice.